Hi guys, how are you? I am Raul from Eat Our Sports Studios. Today, I will discuss about stand-up paddling. I am now in Mamsar Beach and if you see these buildings behind me, this is Al Nada Sharjah. First, I have this paddle here. So now this is my board. So be sure the spins is in your back while you are paddling. This pins is the equipment that control for your navigation. So you cannot go straight without this pins. So your paddle will go left, right. It's difficult for you to control without this. So now I will go up from the board. So for you to go up, you can just post this, put this paddle from in front here and hope in the board slide and stand from the middle. So now I'll do paddling. So here, if you see me, if I want to turn my paddle, I will just push this one more inside in the water, like that, sideways, like that. And I'm going back to you guys. So now I will try to move straight. So I will go back to the more normal paddling position. So like that. So I will aim for your location so I can continue like that. So for example, I will feel my board is going more at the other side. For example, it will go more like that. So that's the right time I have to move this one this side. So, to counter the direction. So, this is the paddle that I'm using now because I'm using this as a stand-up paddle. There are two main types of stand-up paddle. It could be the inflatable or the rigid one. What I have now, this is inflatable. So, I can just pack it, everything in a small bag and transport it easily as a backpack. While the rigid one, it's the advantage of that is when you go to the area, you can just easily paddle directly. Second things to consider is the length of your board. What I have now, this is the 12.6 inches. This is mainly a touring board, meaning you can put more storage from here. So you can do something like if you want to go long distance paddling. Another difference of Sana Paddle is the tip of the board. So if you notice what I have now, this is a pointed tip. Some board you can see is flat here. So the difference, this one is it will break through the water and it will run more faster compared than the flat one. But, comparing, but in terms of stability, the flat one is more stable. Second thing you need to consider is the volume. It looks like complicated, but anyway, if you buy the, it is mentioning how much the weight limit of the, so like this one, it can carry up to 120 kilo. Some maybe 80 kilo, some maybe 60 kilo only. So meaning, if you are 100 kilo and you bought the stand up paddle in which it can carry only 60 kilo, it's impossible for you to balance. Second thing to consider, is the width how wide is your board like for example this one it's not that wide if you are beginners i highly recommend go for wider wider board it's easier for you to balance if you have wider board and i will show you i have one more paddle from here so come with me i will show you this one I have this. 
So maybe you will ask me why I have this type of paddle in which I have actually a stand-up paddle. So I have this chair. Up. Let's get this one down like that. So I have this chair. If you see this chair, I put, I buy I bought this from uh, Decathlon. And I have this chair. If you see this chair, it's very down from the floor. So this is the best chair and it's not that wide as well. So I can keep it down from here. Like that. You see that? So actually this is a stand-up paddle. But look what I can do with this. You stand from here, sit down, and use this. I'm using this as a kayak. So it's very comfortable, it's very stable. And if you are feeling tired, you can just sit back, relax. Sometimes I'm going out with poopy with it. Just stay here in the water, look around, drink your coffee, play some sound, and just like that. So you stand up Adele, you can do something else out of it. So imagine that, you sit down here, you have your cup of coffee. You drink, look around, look at the views. This is what life here in Dubai. Amazing. So I will go back to you guys. So just turn it like that. See? So it's easier to control than the paddle. Uh, sorry, because here, left and right. And also you can move faster than this. Get my coffee. Imagine if I have coffee early in the morning sitting here, paddling. What's that?
Thank you for being with me guys until this time. And I wish to see you next of my training. And if you think this training helped you, please subscribe to my channel. See you and bye-bye.